All right, back on 105.9 The X, it is the X Morning Show. Tim Benz, Bob McLaughlin, a very crowded studio today for Are You Smarter Than? A special edition as we get ready for the X Hard Rock Cafe Halloween Bash. It's the second consecutive year we've been there. A great time last year. Playing for tickets to go is Vince calling from Newcastle. Actually, Vince, you're in. You're going. Uh, what, are you, what are you going dressed as, Vince? Uh, I don't know. I was thinking like Sarah Palin as an Obama supporter. <laughs> That's kind, oh, that's, out there. that's kind of convoluted, but I'm sure you could pull it off. I just pulled it off the top of my head. I didn't plan on, I didn't plan on going or having a costume. So. All right, well, look, when you show up, just go as yourself, and we'll get the hooker zombie to uh, make you up because she's pretty fantastic. <laughs> yeah, she's pretty good at it, actually. All right, sounds good. All right, so you're playing for tickets to see Hollywood Undead. On top of that, Hollywood Undead coming on the 4th here to Pittsburgh at Chez Arena. Tickets available. Uh, you can go online and get those from WXDX.com. Uh, Vince, since it's one against four here, I'm going to let you go first, all right? All right. How's your world geography on Are You Smarter Than? Okay. How's your world geography, Vince? Uh, that's okay, I guess. Better than your hearing. <laughs> By world, I mean outside of Newcastle. Okay, we're cool with that? Wait, there's a world outside of Newcastle? That's exactly what I was looking for. All right, what country borders Spain to the west, Vince? Uh, I'm going to go with Portugal. Portugal is correct. How about that? Good job, Vince. You're one for wow. one. Right out of the chute. Yeah, keep in mind, you're going against two girls here, one with brain damage, that <laughs> went five for five, and are you smarter than? So you got to start strong. Way to go. Brain all damage, right. maybe. Other parts not affected at all. All right, Team Minnie Manson, uh, you guys are up next here with your question. How many legs does a butterfly have? How many legs does a butterfly? Oh, I, I'll give you multiple choice. All right, eight, six, four, or none. I'm going to say six, man. Six? Yeah, man. From Ozzy chimes in with the six. Does the rest of the group agree, or do you want to huddle up a little bit? Minnie Manson, you're the captain, so you get final say on this. I like sixes. Six? <laughs> you like sixes. Very good. Very good. Six it is. That's correct. It is six. So, again, yeah, yeah. the Hard Rock Cafe girls stay hot. Luck stays with them. All right. Uh, one or Two for two right now. Team Minnie Manson goes next on this one. The purchase of what land from the Russians in 1867 became known as Seward's Folly. The purchase of what land from Russia? Go ahead, Libby. Alaska. Alaska is correct. <laughs> there you go, Vince, for your Sarah Palin Ozzy's back there feeding her the answers. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm telling you, man. We the whole team is leaning on well, Ozzy. Ozzy did that big show over there. He did the show in Russia and all those shows up in Alaska. He knows the area very well. True Here's enough. Code, man. <laughs> all right, Vince, you're trailing two to one, so you better get this one right to keep pace, okay? All right, let's do it. In the famous equation E equals MC squared, tell me what E, M, and C stand for. Uh, I think E is energy. Right. Uh, MC, I'm not real, I think the M stands for math. That's correct. Uh, the C, I'm going to go with uh, constant, I don't know. No, that is not correct. It's you in the correct. equation, but that's not what it stands for. You got two-thirds of it right there. So nice effort, Vince, especially considering you're from Newcastle. But uh, you fall a little bit short. Girls you can, girls and guys, I'm sorry. I'm focusing on the white trash and the dumpster hooker here. Sorry, zombie <laughs> hooker. She's the dumpster hooker. You're the white trash zombie. Uh, so what does C stand for? If you guys can steal, then you're in position to win. I'm pretty sure it's the speed of light, man. That is correct. It is, in fact, the speed of light. Ozzy, I thought your Ozzie brain would have been more affected yeah. by the snorting of the ants, Ozzie's but I see that's not so. <laughs> see, what it is, man, is as you get older, it's like everything's new to you, man, so you just remember it more gooder. More gooder, perfect. He's even got the shake down. The, uh, the, yeah, you can't see the shake on the perfect. radio. He's pulling the shake off. You will on the video later today, but it's, right, it, for the it's web. perfect. All right, so if you guys get this one right, you win, and Vince is out for Hollywood Undead, and anybody else out there listening can grab it for free. So here's your question. Name three Canadian provinces. Three Canadian pro Any three Canadian provinces. There's, like, more than three of them. Quebec, Montreal, or no, Quebec. No pressure. <laughs> way, to, way to talk trash. Ozzy's trying to remember the 79 tour. <laughs> Well, Minnie Nance is trying to remember what places he got kicked out of and banned from. <laughs> <coughs> Where are you at, these players? We've got Quebec, <laughs> Vancouver. We'll say one. Vancouver. Quebec, Montreal, and Vancouver. Is that what you said? Yes. You said Quebec. Well, you said Quebec. Yes. And then we we're discussing the other ones. Quebec. All right, we'll go with those. Quebec, Montreal, and Vancouver. All of those 
sadly, are cities. They're not <laughs> provinces. <laughs> so yes, Ozzy, the tour did go through there, but you were somewhere else besides uh, the city. Uh, now, uh, these places are outside of Newcastle, so let's see how you do. Yeah, you do what I said, man. Yeah, we couldn't understand you. All right, go for it, Vince. Can you name three provinces? I'm going to go with uh, Manitoba, Saskatchewan, and... Uh, Uh, Did you just say Minnesota? I'm sorry, Vince. Minnesota. Yeah, Minnesota. He said Manitoba. Oh, Manitoba. I heard him say Manitoba <laughs> first. <laughs> it was a big war. When those pilots flew off. Ozzy's over there ready to jump in. What an idiot, man. <laughs> Vince, in five seconds, I need an answer. Face, Vince. Uh, five, four, three. Ottawa. I'll go with Ottawa. What the hell? Oh, that sadly as well is a city, Vince. You were, you got two right, but the third one was wrong. That's in Ontario, which is a province. Ontario. Okay. Yes, you got two right. So I was gonna throw Sidney Crosby out there with the whole Nova Scotia, but yeah, yeah. yeah. that would have confused you. I was confused thinking one of them ones by the, the little Hudson Bay area up there. Thinking <laughs> what would you say, Putin Bay? The, yeah, no, that's no, no, that's no. in Ohio. That's a state, Vince. No, no, okay, no, 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 it's Canada. I'm the Vince, congratulations, you're going to see the show, but you're not going to see Hollywood Undead because you're not smarter than Team Minnie Manson. That's right. The yeah. girls from the Hard Pretty Rock damn Cafe. impressive, I would have to say. We're going to bring him back every week. In your face, Vince. are a lot harder <laughs> <laughs> Ozzy's heckling, Vince. Vince, we'll see you at the show, okay? All right. Just show up, your name will be on a list, all right? All right, thanks. That means the Hollywood Undead tickets are available.